from Studio 3 at Buzz TV. It's The Horse's Mouth with Tom McManus. All right, welcome into the horse's mouth, of course, at Tommy Max at my bar where everyone has a shot to sit down and tell their story. Brought to our good friends at Yolo Rum with the B Teal segment, the ghost of Brian Sexton this time around, but he's here in spirit. Uh, always great when he's here because he brings on a great guest each and every week. I know both these guys. One, I got a nickname. His name's Money. He's Money. Why is he Money? Because he made all his field goals. That's why he's named Money. Mike Hollis is here. Jim Coffey is here from Three International. Money. Money, how What's are up, brother? you, brother? Good to see you. And good, good to see, see you, Jim. Man. Good to see you again. Fellas, tell us about 3 International. Well, 3 International is a uh, direct sales company that's uh, just over about a year old. Okay. Um, we've done over $90 million in sales worldwide. Okay. We're in 15 countries. Okay. Um, we uh, specialize in cellular absorption. So there's a lot of companies out there with products on the market that don't have any absorption at all. Okay. Uh, we have 11 technologies. Nine of those are exclusive to our company. So okay. we, we are hitting the market running with regards to having great quality products Yep. You can have great quality products out there, but if they're not absorbing, they're worthless. Yep. Okay, so we have the 11 technologies actually okay. adding absorption. Jim, how, how did you get involved in three? Well, actually, Mike called me one day. I've known him since our days back with JDL yep. and all that. Yeah, absolutely. And, uh, you know, and um, I was kind of interested, and he was talking about collagen, and I said, oh, my wife will really like that. And I thought it was actually a topical. I had no idea what I was getting into, to be honest with you. Yep, yep. And so I, I joined anyway, because I trust Mike, and I'm known him a long time and went to my first meeting and I went from a lower level package to a founder's package where I was able to got, you know, buy in and get paid part of the global okay. revenue yeah, yeah, of the yeah. company. Sure, so sure. it was a no brainer for me to become a numbers guy. Yep. Um, but um, since getting in, I was really just planning on taking the uh, supplements. Um, I sold my business about a year and a half ago. Okay. So I'm financially cool. pretty yep. well set. Yeah, yeah, good. And, but next thing you know, I'm taking these products and I'm getting the most unbelievable blood tests because I have some pretty major health issues. Okay. And all my stuff is starting to go back to normal. I'm in homeostasis. All right. My doctor's like saying, what the heck you doing? Yep. And I said, I'm taking three. And I said, look it up in the PDR. But I've got Walgreens pharmacists. I've got, yep. we've got 900 doctors on our team alone um, promoting cool. proactive wellness instead yep. of prescriptions. Yeah, yeah. Well, I tell the college is looking good on you, Mike. Your face has never looked better. <laughs> It's glowing. <laughs> it's glowing. You've been taking the products. Absolutely. What, you've always been in good shape. But yeah. what, what's three do, done for you? Well, the, I'll, I'll, I'll touch on a couple parts, but the, one of the main reasons I got involved is with, during, during the place, the times we were playing, right? Yeah. Um, we had access to all kinds of drugs and stuff. We had any issues, ailments, and inflammatory issues, yeah, whatever. True. Yeah. Um, I had my back issues, four back surgeries. Yep. I still, to that day, up, up until I was taking the products, I was taking Advil on a, yep. on a weekly basis, but during the time I was playing, it was a daily basis. Yep. So my, my liver my kidneys hated me yeah. um, so I wanted to try one of the products was called revive and it's our anti-inflammatory and uh, okay. I can proudly say since March 30th of last year I've not taken an Advil once okay. because of this one product wow. then that epigen says a lot yeah, yeah epigenetics if you've never heard of epigenetics it's yep. a, the balance of your of your genes up regulating good genes mm -hmm. down regulating bad genes mm -hmm. our products actually affect epigenetics and so there's inflammatory genes that are actually down regulated which on four of the products we're taking of course that uh, affects uh, those genes in a good way mm -hmm. uh, they down regulate the inflammatory genes, which helps right. with the inflammation. So with the absorption rate being so high or so good, like that kind of the anti-inflammatory has got to pretty much affect you right away, I would imagine, or pretty close pretty to Pretty quick, it, yeah. Right? yeah. Like Advil, you take four or five Advil, you know, it knocks out whatever you've got going on, but it's not the best for your stomach right. or liver or anything like that, kidneys, well, that kind of thing. My wife and I had just moved um, into a new house, and, you know, we kind of pinned ourselves against the wall by um, committing to having a event for three at our house, which we had 150 okay. people at. Okay. And I didn't know where this conversation was going, but I get it now. <laughs> the night before, <laughs> I'm laying in bed. I'm thinking of an Eric Church center or something. <laughs> I moved like 200 boxes, you know, over the last course of time. Plus, I had a knee replacement yep. during that, so I was kind of pushing myself. And I'm laying in bed the night before this party, and I'm like, yeah. Rose, I don't feel good. I think I have a fever. And I have a 100.7 fever. I have stage four cirrhosis of the liver. Oh, jeez. Um, okay. Which was brought on. I mean, I drank some, but I wasn't an alcoholic drinker. I took okay. a lot of ibuprofen mm -hmm. and stuff. I played yeah. ice hockey. I was a snow ski instructor, yeah. speed skater, baseball. 
everything to do with my just niece. like what Mike was talking about. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, just, I so I kind of got right. in for the same thing. I take matter of fact the revive over okay. here. I take two of these in the morning, two at night every day. I take two of these every day. Okay. This is the eternal. This these two alone will in, reduce the inflammation in your body upwards of like fifteen hundred percent. Okay. So I started seeing really good things happening with my health. Yeah. So I started sharing with friends. Good. And man. next thing you know, I yeah. got two hundred and thirty yeah. people below me, and good. I wasn't gonna work this as so a So you change your people's lives. Absolutely. We are. Through better health. Yep. That's health, fantastic. Health and wealth, because you can make some money with this if you yeah, just refer it. And absolutely. Mm -hmm. That's great. That's good. I'm glad it's going well for you guys. Sounds like great products. Uh, did we miss any products as we wrap it up here? Uh, well, the Vitality. This is yeah, our yeah, core of one. This is Vitality. Actually, I left a box of this for you, Brian and, um, okay. and Aaron. Um, yeah. But you'll notice this in about three or four days. You'll notice okay. your energy level. They don't need it. I need yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. More than they your mental Trust acuity. Me. My voice may need something, but that's about it. <laughs> I'll but your mental rest. acuity goes uh, through the roof. Yep. Um, okay. You'll, you'll, you'll notice I'll things. check it out. I will. I'll try it out. All right. As we wrap up, it's the Beat Teal segment. i got to ask you, what does it mean to Beat Teal? Jimmy, well, go first. I, I, I lived here when the, the Jaguars came to town. Yep. And I can honestly say that there was a transformation in this city like you've never seen. Yeah. Um, people wanted to come to town. You see people like you and Mike, I mean, yep. ex-Jaguar players are all still living here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You know, of us, you know, they're still living it's here. Like for, Seventy, I mean, it's for, amazing, for a yeah. reason though, because yeah. of the area. Um, yep. But um, this town would not be the same without the Jaguars. No doubt about it. I mean, if they lost the Jaguars, it would be right. So, beat to me and get the stadium deal done. <laughs> get that deal done. I like Just it. I like keep it. building the team. I think we're yeah. going in the right direction. Yeah. yeah. Um, yeah. I am sure. a season ticket holder again. Yeah. Uh, I saw you yeah, there last year. Time. Going in, matter of fact, I think. What's that? I saw you going in last year one time. Oh yeah. That's right. That's right. And we'll be down there. How about you, Mike? What do you mean to be too? Well, I'm going to piggyback on what Jim said as far as the Jaguars. You know, we've been yep. here. We, we still, as, as, as retired Jaguars, we still do a lot of stuff in the community. So we're, yep. we're here to help. Um, yep. We were part of that, you know, original Jaguars team and, yep. and kind of got the excitement there. And so um, I feel like I've been put on this planet to help people. And so yep. I'm helping people with this. I'm helping people with just, you know, just uh, yep. uh, show my uh, support in the community and, and then being a, being a Jaguar. Also put on the planet to making kicks and getting the nickname that's money. A, that's right. So there that's you right. go. That helps. Tell us. Thanks so much. Congratulations. Best of luck all the way. All right. Hey, listen, if you want to uh, get more information, make sure you go to their profiles. Uh, you can see it on the dailynewsnetwork.com website. You'll see how you can yourself obtain these great products. Until next time, stay safe out there, be cool, and we'll see you right here on The Horse's Mouth. Cheers. Even though we do have two different liquors, it's still one name. It's Yolo Rum, and at the end of the day, it's how you feel. And Yolo Rum, you only live once, and that's more prevalent. That's becoming more prevalent as far as the attitude and the mindset with how people live their lives. And it's not really, it's not about how it used to be as far as people doing dumb stuff out here. It's more of their understanding the value of their life. And if we can bring that presence of the meaning behind life and what it means to fulfill whatever you need to fulfill in your life that makes you feel enjoyable about what you're doing, that's what YOLO will bring out as well.